What up you guys, this is Eric once again from RC Reductions and we are here with a new rig for the channel. This is the Losi Baja Ray. This is the Raptor Ray in the King Shock version. Went ahead and picked up this bad boy last week at my local hobby shop here in New Arizona. Got it for a good deal, got it on that winter sale special. Here she is. We purchased the 3S pack. So we're gonna be running that 3S 5000, the big old fat pack. You can see here it is. We're already gonna make some suspension adjustments here quickly. Uh, Cause this front is just way too big low. Uh, right now we're gonna go ahead and work on it. So let's roll the montage. later yo what up you guys we are back at the shop and it has been probably a while since i've talked to you guys um today is currently wednesday the day i filmed all that stuff on was sunday so here we are i'm home from work so went ahead and um i did a few things this week um i'll go ahead and talk about that briefly so when i purchased all the shocks the rear shocks actually came with a spare secondary spring as well as a primary spring and while i was tuning the shocks i decided to put that that rear secondary spring which is a stiffer one on the front just because i wanted to be a little more stiffer by the way i have a tire underneath so that's not the right height but i did put put in that new secondary spring and it feels really good i also tightened up the collars a little bit so it should be good now and that's pretty much it for the front 35 way oil and then the rear is where the, all the magic happens I did some major tuning with the rear. Um, that 35 way oil was just way too thick for this setup. So I went ahead and put about 80% of olive oil, cooking oil into the Proline shock. And I topped it off with some 35 way oil. And in the stock shock here, um, I'm running about 50% 35 way oil. So that's the route I went with. There's a lot of taking off the shock, taking on the shock. Um, these holes are just a nightmare. I need WD-40, I need to trim it. So really big pain in the butt, but nonetheless, I got it on and it looks freaking amazing. Uh, it feels really good. Before, with the, when I put all 35 oil in the Proline shock, the rebound was just super slow and I just felt like the spring wasn't really doing anything, so. Um, this one had to put some different oil, some very light oil in it, and that uh, feels good now. Trust me, it's not springy. It just it feels like like the OEM, but with a little more travel. And the front feels freaking solid. So definitely a cool setup. I'm pretty happy to go out there and go test. But let me know, should I, should I even run this thing, guys? Like, it's just too clean to go play with. Oof, man, this thing looks really sick. But there is the Baja Ray. In all its glory, guys. Really sick car. And I'm really happy to see what it brings to the channel. So, guys, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comments below. And I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thank you, guys, and have a good day. Eric out. Peace.